Hi, Karen Wells, Independent Sensi Consultant, Lavington, New South Wales. My Sensi Club and also the Scent of the Month Consultant Kit for August 2021 has arrived. The temperature has dropped and my ears are getting cold. Um, so <laughs> uh, to get this video done, I won't put my heater on because it takes hours uh, to heat up just this small area. So we'll get this done quickly. And... Um, because I'd like to show you what's in my club before I actually put it away. It will change. Um, there are things that I popped in this month's Scentsy Club because it closed out before we were actually told uh, of the dif discontinued items and also items that will be returning in the new catalogue. And um, there are a couple of things that I didn't want to miss out, miss out on. So... The first thing we'll talk about is the August 2021 scent of the month, which is blackberry, oh, vanilla blackberry. I can smell it already. What I've done is I've taken off the protector and left it sitting for a while so um, the fragrance can be more prominent to me. It is dark purple wax, which is beautiful. And it was all blackberry. So it says vanilla blackberry, which I find interesting because I don't actually smell any vanilla. It is all blackberry. Very nice. I'll be very interested to get that in my warmers and make samples. We get six in our consultant's kit, which allows us to melt some for ourselves. And uh, you can sell them if you really want. Um, I generally don't sell them. I usually use them for myself or... Um, and make samples, send them out. So vanilla blackberry, um, scent of the month, um, August 2021. What also came with my consultant kit was a new product training guide for the new up and coming spring summer 2021 catalogue. I always get one of these. I think it is a valuable resource if you're a consultant. There are hints and tips and information on the up and coming catalogue products that I find invaluable. There will always be questions um, that perhaps you, you haven't tried the product. Um, one of the products that I find particularly interesting is the air purifier, and that's a bit of a, um, a sneak peek, which, you know, it's up on the uh, consult our consultants' websites at the moment. Um, but it'll be interesting to see how this goes because um, the new air purifier is something new and I now know all about it. If I have a customer that rings up, a friend customer, and I'm... I'll sound as if I know what I'm talking about. Product training guide, fantastic resource. So, Sensi Club. Um, I ha the first thing I've got is a 15 watt globe. I seem to be blowing globes like crazy. And um, the other thing I always have in my Sensi Club are cotton cleanups. I've got two bags of those and a cotton cleanup. If you haven't experienced them beforehand, is a large cotton pad with a handle that allows you to soak up hot wax out of uh, full-size warmers. Now, I use usually two cubes per warmer, and as a general rule, I can clean up three full-size warmers with one cotton pad. Now, sometimes it does leave a little bit of uh, residue in the last one, but that's okay. You can clean that out with the tissue or another small cotton bud. Um, but I love these. I always, always have those in my Scentsy Club. And that's a benefit of a Scentsy Club. These are not always available on your um, on the website because they do sell out or they have been selling out anyway. Uh, it's just that if you have it in your Scentsy Club, they will actually make sure this is Scentsy I'm talking about, will make sure that they cover all Scentsy Club orders for cotton cleanups. The other thing is always get my bar, which I think is fantastic. So I was talking about um, when they discontinue products and when they actually have limited time offers and that sort of thing. If you have a bar that you absolutely love and you want more of, um, you can always stock up. 
buy a few uh, or you can pop it in your Scentsy Club and Scentsy will actually pour it and make it for you and send it to you for as long as it is in your Scentsy Club. So a lot of my uh, the items in my Scentsy Club are actually discontinued items, which is a feature that I really like. And the other thing is if you get to a certain amount, um, they will actually take 10% off everything in your Scentsy Club. So that's a bonus as well. Okay, we will get started. So the first thing that's in my Scentsy Club is um, Pink Sugarberry Mint. Now I did actually get the consultant's uh, kit of these. This was a scent of the month just a, recent, just a short time ago. Um, but I don't get a lot of mint. It is just a sweet sugary scent for me. Um, but I, I think I've used them all and I wanted to do a comparison between, because I quite enjoyed it, but I wanted to do a comparison between sh pink sugar mint, <laughs> pink sugar berry mint and a limited time offer of True Love Awaits, which is a Disney princess. I thought this was going away at the end of June, so I did pump it in my Scentsy Club, um, but it has recently been taken out because it is returning in the catalogue. So um, that, again, is a lovely um, feminine um, scent, perhaps a little bit floral, um, more floral than pink sugar berry mint, um, but uh, that's another favorite of mine as well then oh, we've got to bring back my bar which I've got two of and that's marshmallow mint I just absolutely love this um, it I'm not usually a mint lover but this one's lovely the marshmallow once the mint is actually melted off you've got beautiful marshmallow which actually can actually last a couple of days in a mini warmer which is very nice um, a discontinued bar well they would discontinued as well bring back my bar from a couple of uh, seasons ago so this was discontinued out of the catalogue. It is sugar cookie. I really love this. It's a good mixer for me. Um, that'll stay there for a while. Uh, from the most recent uh, Bring Back My Bar, it is a caramel pear crisp. I'm not sure whether this will stay. I think um, whipped vanilla pear, which was a Bring Back My Bar from a couple of uh, um, seasons ago, I think that one's a better one, but I do actually want to do a comparison. So um, there you go. And my pink, uh, my whipped vanilla pear, I think doesn't actually come until um, September. I have got two happy birthdays. Um, and I love this scent. I really, it's a mixer for my, me. Um, I've got two of them and they've just, I can't find the other one just yet. It must be in here somewhere. Um, but um, happy birthday. I'm glad that I've got that in my, um, here we go. I've got, I'm glad I've got this in my Scentsy Club. Um, because even though Birthday Wishes um, has just recently come out, I'm going to compare this um with birthday wishes because this is more of a it is a stronger scent for me it has more body to it i i find birthday wishes very vanilla-ish and it doesn't last for very long <laughs> from the easter collection i have toasted marshmallow and i should have a couple more of these where is it so I've actually got, oh, that's three. And I've changed it since then as well. Um, toasted marshmallow. I have four toasted marshmallow from the Easter collection. In my next um, lot, I've actually changed this down to two because um, I'm starting to get a store of these. And that's the thing. When they first announce that it's going to be discontinued or go away, put in a few more and then you can build up a stock and then you can gradually over time and change things. And that's the other thing about Scentsy Club. It is a manipulatable. You can change it. You can go in, you can change the amount providing it hasn't been discontinued, you can add to it. 
If it's been discontinued, no longer available, you can only take away. So four of these, I've changed it down to two. And if for some reason I decide that that's I need more, I, I can't do that anymore. Um, but I do have a store of them. Four now sort of adds it up to uh, quite a bit more. So toasted uh, marshmallow, absolutely love that. Uh, from the recent Bring Back My Bar crumb, crumb Top, I've taken this one out. I think I've taken it out, um, but I wanted another one because it is a bit of a mixer. And uh, Caramel Sugar Cone, I love this one. I think this is my favourite bakery out of the last Bring Back My Bar. Now, they are all not available, discontinued now. So, um Sensi Club, if it's in your Sensi Club, that's the only way you're going to get it unless it comes back again. And um, Apple Butter Frosting. Now, it is a new packaging, which I'm very pleased about because, and I've complained about it enough, um, I was very unhappy when I was getting um, what appeared to be old stock. But this is certainly a new bar, so I'm very happy about that. And that'll stay in my Scentsy Club because I do actually really like it. Pretty and Plum, love this one. It'll stay in my Scentsy Club. It is really rich plum pastry scent for me. Um, replaced the Sugar Plum, was it? Sugar Plum pastry? Oh, I can't remember what it was. But anyway, it's gone. Snuggle Up, absolutely love this one. This is a lovely bathroom scent for me. Uh, no, not bathroom, bedroom. Lovely bedroom scent for me. Will stay in my Scentsy Club because I really love this. Now, this is very similar to um, Lavender and Violets. and uh, I, But this one here is sort of like a softer one. So I do like that one. I've also got my hero in there and this will stay for a while um i did actually buy a few before it became discontinued it was the from the father's day collection last year and it is a masculine scent i love this it does very well in my spare room for a couple of days and it's actually so strong that it quite often takes over the rest of the unit <laughs> which is fine because i love it um, simply strawberry and this is to me a very authentic strawberry scent I love this one it is a mixer for me though because I'm not really um, into fruity fragrances but this and happy birthday is just beautiful it's very much like a um, strawberry pound cake cheesecake strawberry and cake very nice That'll stay there for a while as well. Uh, Clementine and Cranberry. This is from the last Bring Back My Bar. I do actually have a few from when it was scent of the month, but um, this is a lovely deep uh, citrus scent for me. I really love it. And uh, it'll stay there for a couple of rounds until uh, I get too many, perhaps. Fiji Flower. Now, Fiji Flower was from the Summer Collection. I didn't have much success with the Summer Collection. Um, this was okay, um, and but it was very light. Um, I did actually like it in my bedroom. This is it's actually melted quite a bit, so I don't know where it's been sitting. And I did get a lot of uh, apple. And actually, now I can smell it here. I do actually get a bit of floral. I wondered whether it was too new. It hadn't been uh, cured long enough. And there's a lot of talk at the moment about waxes curing. So anyway, I've got Fiji flower there. I I may take it out. Um, we'll see how we go. Um, but once the weather gets warmer, um, and I find that uh, at the moment, winter, it is very hot. It's very hard to scent my unit anyway, and I'm just finding that all the warmers are struggling at the moment. And um, normally, you know, uh, in autumn and spring, they do much better than in winter. Um, so we'll see how it goes. So I'll sit, sit on that for a while and try it again. Um, and as I said, my next Scentsy Club won't be until September. Um, so I should be 
maybe decide maybe i'll get another one who knows because it is a pretty scent um banana berry i get two of these because i absolutely love this it is very light it was from the easter collection and um i actually fill my kitchen with this if it lasts a day it's still a lovely banana scent absolutely love that one getting to the bottom of the barrel i've got experiment 624 which is the angel and this to me is a strawberry or a um berry milkshake um and i don't know whether it's the goji berries or whatever it is but i really like this um i will actually keep this in my club for a little while and uh melt it when it gets a bit warmer but i love that fills up my kitchen with a lovely um strawberry milkshake um sakura blossom now i love sakura blossom it is very light um and it's probably lighter than i normally like my scents um but at certain times of year this is an absolutely beautiful uh, light floral love it sakura blossom and i'll keep that because i love it thunderstorm from the last bring back my bar last uh a nice dark blue wax and it's interesting because i want i love this i really do i have bought old crusty bars in d stashes i've had them in swaps that sort of thing and i love thunderstorm it's just interesting that i'm finding that these newly poured ones aren't as strong as the old crusty bar that i have been getting from d stashes so i will keep this it's lovely but it really only lasts a day or a day a full day um whereas the older bars seem to last a couple of days at least so anyway we'll see how we go Ginger Spice is a scent of the month from February and I thought that this might actually be discontinued and I love this. I've got a couple of them, um, but I, it is a favourite and uh, that will stay there for a while as well. Getting to the end, um, Apple Blossom Breeze, which is a recent uh, scent of the month and it, it is very light. Um, but again, it actually reminds me very much of Sakura Blossom. So um, I'll keep a few of these because I do actually really like it. It has performed quite well in my bedroom. So, and lucky last, Vanilla Oud. Um, beautiful, rich, vanilla -y, masculine. Mm, very nice. I love that one. So there you go. That's my Scentsy Club. Um, and as I said, my September Scentsy Club will include my three monthly and also my two monthly. This is my two, two monthly. And I've manipulated it. I've changed things. I've taken things out, put things in um, because we were advised of, as I said, of all the um, discontinued items and all the items coming back. And... Uh, I've changed things up, pop things in, and um, that'll be in September. It's going to be huge. Like this was pretty big, but uh, September will be bigger. Thank you for like. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. I'll put my details below. Um, and uh, Victoria is in lockdown again. Sydney's in lockdown. Like, oh, gosh, this is never going to end. Please stay safe. Happy melting and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.